It's not your vehicle, it's the people's okay. vehicle. Guess what? No. Yes, no, you, okay. you aren't going to record this vehicle. Please. I'm going like to tell you that right now. What's your name, badge number? You know, don't even, don't even, don't even. Why don't you shut up? You told me to shut up? Yeah, I told you to oh, shut up. A constitutionally protected activity cannot be construed as harassment. It's not yes. Welcome back to the Lackluster Channel. Today's story was submitted by Freakin' Media and Michigan Constitutional Crusader. On December 10th of 2021, the two were filming on a public sidewalk in River Rouge, Michigan, when security personnel from a nearby shop approached them. We can totally record you in public. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should stay inside if you don't want to be on my camera. After returning to his business, the guard called 911, prompting the response of multiple uniformed officers of the River Rouge Police Department. Soon after, the officers made contact with Freakin' Media and MCC. No, I don't need to. Yes, you do. No, I don't. my personal space first. I'm not in your personal space. You walked yes, up you to are. me. Okay, because I'm walking up to my patrol vehicle because my computer is in there. You're driving from stuff. the right side? What? That means nothing. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All I can do is We can ask. record inside okay. your vehicle. You cannot record inside your vehicle. Absolutely, we can. Okay, yes, I can. I just took a lean tag you, glass. You, that is not privy to what, Okay, do you know do that you that know is not privy information for you? Exactly, so you got to shut it. Have you taken a lean tag glass? The term Lean TAC class is referring to the Law Enforcement Information Network classes that Michigan officers are required to take as a part of their continued education. While the privacy of privileged information is likely covered in their classes, based on the date of this video, the most recent Lean TAC class involved adding non-binary to driver's licenses. While there may be sensitive information on the officer's laptop, if an item or information is in plain view, and the viewer is lawfully in the place where they observe the item or information, then the eye cannot commit the trespass condemned by the Fourth Amendment. It is the duty of the record keeper to maintain the security of their records. Now, a sergeant arrives on scene. It's your requirement to shut the laptop. I asked you. It's your requirement. It's cool. Cool. I can still record inside the vehicle, though. Nothing. He's all he's all okay. upset. We're recording inside his vehicle yes, through the window. I'm supposed to be recording in my vehicle. Sure, I can. Know. That's no, not your not vehicle. It's the people's okay. vehicle. Stop, Guess what? Stop, stop. No. Yes. No, you you aren't going to record in his vehicle. Please. I'm going like to tell you that right now. The sergeant tells them that they will not be recording the vehicles. But before we dive into that, it's hard to find balanced military analysis these days. And if you're watching this video, you probably agree. It's also hard to find unbiased news. The press is financially incentivized to push divisive content to generate clicks. Social media further divides people into tribal bubbles, fanning the flames of polarization. And before you know it, you're in an echo chamber without any diverse perspectives, and each side receives a different version of the facts. This is a huge problem for all of us, but thankfully, ground news is working to solve it. Ground News is a first-of-its-kind website and app that lets you compare how any news story is being covered across the political spectrum. But it's not just a news aggregator. It's a tool with a bunch of easy-to-use features that helps you be more confident you're getting the full picture. The bias distribution chart shows you which media outlets are reporting on an issue and where they fall on the political spectrum. You can even follow the issues and places you care most about. But my favorite feature is the blind spot feed, where you can see stories that are underreported by either side of the political spectrum. If you're looking for a better way to stay informed about current events, check out the website or download the free app by visiting ground.news. Links will be in the description and pinned comment. And now, back to our video. Yes, well, okay. you are going to record this vehicle. Please. I'm going like to tell you that soup, right like now. Well, it's, not, it's not unlawful. Do you, you know what plain view doctrine is? You're not do you do know what plain view doctrine is? Okay. But that means if I can you, see I, it, I can record it. No, you yes, can't. Yes, yes, yes. That's not a law. That's not a law. Anyway. That's not a law. They say it's Listen to me. Okay. What are you guys doing out here? I'm taking pictures. Why? Because I want to. It's called public photography, photojournalism, video journalism. Okay. Protected under the First Amendment. I'm just asking. Constitutionally protected activity. I just told you. Why? I'm a video journalist. I go around and I take pictures and videos. And I sell those pictures and videos. I don't know. Journalism. For what Freedom of the press. For what company? Freaking media. For what company? Freaking media. It's called freaking media. Freaking media. Do you have a card? No, I don't. 
Why not? Because I don't have any. I left them at home. Oh, freaking media. Freaking media. Huh? What's your name? My friends call me Spanky Pants. You want to be my friend? You can call me Spanky Pants. Otherwise, you got to call me Sir. I don't. I don't have to call you anything. Well, well. Call you Sir. Oh, you can call me whatever. Why are y'all surrounding people for? Like y'all want to do something to somebody? Wow. Is that what y'all do? Thugs with guns trying to intimidate somebody? Huh? Who is a thug? thug? Yes, thug? Men with guns who try and intimidate citizens for flexing their constitutional rights. I wouldn't be a thug. No. During that interaction, an officer explains to MCC why they are there. The gentleman said that you are harassing customers walking in and out of the store. Well, that's funny. As long as you don't harass the customers in and out, we never harassed anybody. Okay, I'm just explaining to you. You just told to me. Right. I go around. The gentleman said you're harassing customers in and outside the store. I don't know if you did. I don't know if you did. So with that being said, I don't care if you're on the sidewalk or not because you can be on the sidewalk with a camera, whatever you want to do. Right. As long as you don't harass the customers, we are all set. Yeah, we're not harassing anybody. That's perfectly fine. That's all that matters. As long as you're not, that's it. Can I get your badge number, please? 55. Thank you. I don't have to call you anything. Well, I mean, let's see, sir. that's badge 24. And what's your name? I'm the sergeant. No, what's your name? Well, you're not getting my name. You ain't getting my name. Oh, okay. That's all right. I can find your name out through your badge number. You can. You can try. Try? Really? Yeah. How much you want to bet I do? I don't want to bet you anything. Mm. So you're going to lose your money. What's your name, badge number? You know, don't even, don't even, don't even. Why don't you shut up? You told me to shut up? Yeah, I told you to okay, shut up. so now. Yeah, he told you to shut up. Now, now, what? now you're interfering with my investigation here. That's protection. No, you're telling them not to say their name and badge know. numbers. I already gave him my badge. He'd be oh, already well, gave then I apologize. I'm, I'm talking the to boss. this guy. I'm, I'm in charge here, so I can okay. tell him what to do if I need to. You don't tell okay, me to shut up. Not I can tell you to shut up. Yeah, I can tell anybody I want to to shut up. But when you're, when you're involving an incident, something that we're here on, we're doing our job, you aren't going to tell me to shut up. Sure I can. I don't have to assist you in your investigation. The bottom line is you guys are real tough with us because you know that we actually are upstanding citizens. We are going to uphold the law. We are not. You're supposed to uphold the law, right? Go walk and get down. We're trying to reason with you guys. What's that? Go walk on some other streets and tell people to shut up. Okay. Okay. I will. Okay. I absolutely will. Wouldn't be the first time. Why are you guys here? Can you just answer me the question? Just recording in public. Why? Because we can. It's a hobby. Well, that's not my problem. That's a no, them problem. Gonna, that's a them problem. No, no, no. If my camera can't if cause a disturbance. If you're disturbing the peace, my, I'm I will not. take you to jail. Oh, and I I'm not dis- de- define disturbing the peace, sir. Define disturbing define the peace. You. you could talk to the judge about it. Oh, is that right? Yeah, well, you, you got to have evidence of the fact, sir. What did you say? You got to have evidence that I was disturbing the peace. Really? Standing on a sidewalk with a camera? Really? Conver- conversing with police? That's disturbing the peace? By standing on a public sidewalk. That's really? that's called ca- that's causing a scene, disturbing the peace because I'm on a sidewalk with a camera? Really? That will not hold up in court. I promise you. Not even close. Disturbing the peace is one of those laws that both federal and state courts have attacked for their pitfalls in violating free speech and assembly rights. And MCL 750.170, Disturbance of Lawful Meetings, is no different. The law generally states that any person who shall make or excite any disturbance, where citizens are peacefully and lawfully assembled, shall be guilty of a misdemeanor. It is so vague that almost anything can be construed as a violation of the code. In fact, in the 2007 case of Leonard v. Robinson. Leonard was arrested for saying God damn while addressing the township board. However, the Sixth Circuit Court of Appeals found that no reasonable officer would have found probable cause to arrest Leonard because the First Amendment protects this sort of uninhibited debate. Officer Robinson lost his qualified immunity for making such an arbitrary arrest. And it's likely that these officers would too if they attempt to do the same with freaking media and MCC for filming on a public sidewalk. Astounding. I, I didn't know standing on a sidewalk with a camera could be construed as disturbing the peace. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I think you yeah. don't. I, I don't think you're right. Um, yeah. Have, do you, have you read the MCL on I disturbing explain, the peace? Can I explain? Sure. Okay. If we 
get multiple calls about people feel like they're being violated because they're being reported as they're walking into somewhere uh -huh. or doing other things because actually this right here uh -huh. is a medical and recreational uh -huh. facility. Uh -huh. So it's people that have medical reasons for why they take marijuana. Uh -huh. And maybe they face don't want to, they don't want their face on the internet okay. being exposed. Yeah, they shouldn't they be in public then. Why wouldn't they be? I'm not harassing okay. anybody. I haven't spoke I'm to anyone. I'm trying to explain something well, to him. So, like I'm saying, so just like huh? I'm saying, excuse me. You said I, I asked him answer. something. I'm, yeah, yeah, I'm listening. I'm, I'm listening. I'm my answer to you so that you can know. Like I said, you see it says medical, correct? Uh -huh. So some people use medical marijuana. Sure, but I do. I have a medical marijuana card. So would you want somebody to I don't care. Or you don't care? I don't some, care. And some people do care. I don't care, but it's not a violation so of the law to do. If you're harassing huh? me, I'm not harassing anybody. In order to harass someone, I have to speak to them, right? Okay, is that camera, true? No, if no, you put a camera no. in really? Face, that's considered harassment. I didn't put my camera in anybody's okay, face. So I didn't know that. So now you're answering a question to me. Okay, I'm saying you did. Well, they're liars. I have it all on video. Then you may be a liar. I, I may be, but I've got it on video to prove what I'm that's saying. Fine. But all I'm telling you. That's why I record, so so I can prove liars wrong. If you're going to harass people, I'm not I'm harassing I'm anybody. Here. I'm not I'm harassing here. anybody. You can't talk to us. Why? I am talking to why you. Why are you being like this? Being like, like what? I am discussing this with you. The, what harassment well, is? Do you know what? Her, no, this I is. I know like, what it is. I've been a cop for ten years. Yes, I know what it is. I don't care how long you've been a cop. See what I mean? You, 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 I don't care how long you've been a cop, dude. You don't know me. This is my everyday voice. This is how I always sound. You don't know me. I don't. This is how I always sound. I don't. But, but I'm, I'm telling you, I've read, read I've sorry. read the Michigan Compiled Law for harassment. Go to school. Okay, and what I'm doing does not meet that because you, you understand, harassing. you understand. You're harassing. No. Can I ask you a question? A constitutionally protected you activity go cannot be jail. construed as harassment or suspicious. Under the question? MCL, we, this is a constitutionally pro pro protected you activity. You not when you're harassing people walking in and out of okay. business. Okay, now let's now let's go over the MCL. Let's go over. Oh my gosh. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Go ahead. I don't want to talk um, to this guy no more. My question is just a general. I'm the boss. You gotta, I don't, you're not my boss. You work but for the I public. Am, you work for the public until I, tell I break the law. Quit walking up on uh, me. Like I don't you, have to quit. You're anyway. trying to touch me. I'm not trying yeah, to touch you. Yeah, you are. Anybody. You're walking up on me like you're trying, trying to touch, touch me. Anybody. And then you want to say I assaulted I'm you. Not, I know how the game works, dude. You're not fooling me. I'm not. Can I, I, can can I ask a question or no? Okay. What? Just This is just an out of curiosity question so I can know why. Sure. Or, you know, what's the reasoning to it or anything like that. Um, like what you guys like? What's like? I don't want to public photography. Person. Public photography. Okay. This is not a crime. Going out and I, recording okay, in public. Okay. No, I, listen. I, you want to? Okay. Yeah. Listen. I asked you why. Yes. You said it. You don't got to go into. It's not a crime. All that. All that. This, that's that's what I'm telling you. That's why I'm oh. doing it. Okay. So it's flexing wanna, our. It's flexing so our constitutional rights. You want, okay. Like some people open carry guns to flex constitutional rights. I so carry a camera. Let me ask you this. As a member of the press. I'm gonna go back a few more questions. Cool. Okay. You had. Yeah. Yeah. We thugs with guns, right? Uh huh. So, say just the regular person walking down the street got a gun. Are they a thug? No, because they don't have a badge. Okay. So, since I went to a class, got a badge, and I work in the community that I reside uh -huh. in, live in, uh -huh. I love my community. Okay. That's all great. I'm a thug. Not necessarily. Okay, but mo so most most cops with because, most cops are thugs. You, they're they're you, tyrants I'm, with guns, and okay. they like to they so like you see, just you like see he's words. trying to say just like he's trying to say I'm harassing people, even though I didn't didn't speak to anybody i know i know but we're not worried about what i'm doing is lawful what they want you're not giving me what i want we're having a conversation you have a good day and so i can't tell i can't show the world how you guys act if you how what do you mean how we act we're how you're acting you're, you're, i didn't do anything menacing to this business they're a law-abiding citizen i didn't do it and i'm a law-abiding citizen he doesn't look like it why doesn't because i have a camera i'm not harassing nobody read the mcl for harassing when you go home don't tell me to read read that because it says at the very end that carry that a constitution Constitutionally protected activity cannot be construed as harassment. It's not yes, yes. Hey, the, uh, recording in public a, as a people's faces. No, I didn't get nobody's face. Correct. Do you have proof? You did. Do you have proof? I got well, somebody's face. Just show it to the judge. I don't. I don't have to prove my in, my guilt. If I, arrest I don't have. You. No, for, you're going to arrest me, and it'll be an unlawful arrest. Okay. And then you're opening yourself up to a lawsuit, losing your qualified immunity, costing no. the city of River Rouge no. a huge amount of Absolutely money not. for an unlawful arrest. No, not when you're. Yes, sir. Not when because actually it has to happen in your presence in order for you to arrest me for it. It's a misdemeanor. It has to happen in your presence. Oh, you'll still take me so you don't care about the law? Hey, boss man. Yeah. The last thing I have to say is what we just talked about before you came out. 
when I said, or oh, you even you said it yourself. You said most cops yes. are thugs with guns. Yes. But guess what? You in the wrong city to meet cops with thugs with guns. Well, you know, you just know. like he's 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 a generalizing us as as you know. a bad person because I have a camera. All cops look alike. They all have badges. They all have guns. And most of them are tyrannical and want to Yeah, I can be smart. I can be a smart ass because that's constitutionally protected too under the First Amendment. Human being and just be nice. I was. No, you. Yet I most certainly was. No, you. I most certainly was. I I explained to you what we was doing. You tried to say I was harassing. I was not. I don't care what they told you. People lie all the time, don't they? People lie all the time. But I have evidence to prove that I wasn't. So maybe you should be more concerned about my evidence. You want me? You want me to rewind it? All right, guys. Hey, record me. So I'm gonna stop my video so I can show. Freaking media attempts to play the video for the sergeant to show that they never approached anyone, let alone harass anyone. The sergeant continues to question and belittle freaking media, and eventually dismisses himself. See, there's one of your officers sitting right there. Okay. I don't know which one it was. But what does it no. matter? Oh, I, I, that's fine. It's my city, not yours. Okay. No, this is the people's city. Yeah, and mine. It's, it's not yours. You don't own it. You work for but the you people. You can go ahead and you talk work to the people, people in this city, and they'll tell you the same thing. Well, that's I fine. If the, if the people city. love you, that's okay. awesome. That's what we're looking they for. Do. Good cops that uphold their oath, they honor the citizens' rights, and they're professional, and they're courteous, no matter if I'm an asshole or not. Because when you hired on to be a cop, you, you said you would be professional and courteous at all times. I'm not putting my finger in your face. It's right here. Don't put it in my face. I mean, it's not in your face. It's not in your face. This is not in your face. You guys got your body cameras on? Good deal. This is not in your face. I'm in my personal space. It's not in your face. Is pointing illegal? Is pointing illegal. All right, help. I'm going to back up so I can put some distance. Most of the officers depart, leaving one officer on scene, who eventually tells them that he agrees with what they do. There you go, guys. Another uh, Taylor Tucky type town here, guys. They think they own this town. They don't think they work for the people. He's mad. He's taking off in a hurry. Yeah, they work for the people of River Rouge. It's not that the people of River Rouge are ran and owned by this police department. They ain't gonna make you sit here and babysit us all night, are they? Oh, you're choosing to be here? Cool. We have no ill will or intent, man. I appreciate you trying to keep your community safe, though, brother. I can't hear you, bro. You mind if I step a little closer? Cool. That's my only thing with all this is... I, I agree with you. I think you should go to the film. I don't care. Right. But what bothers me is that... We agree. <laughs> and that you're also saying thank you for protecting the community, all that stuff. Yeah. None of the officers provided their names. Freaking Media and Michigan Constitutional Crusader are still waiting for a response to their FOIA requests. I have edited out a significant portion of the two videos used to create this video to see the unedited versions and to check out the body cam footage when it is released. Use the links below to visit their channels. And while you're there, let them know I sent you. Thanks for watching. If you have a video you'd like me to review, email it or send it in via Facebook Messenger. You can also view this and other other content on my website. If you're new here, subscribe for future content. If you've been around for a while, remember to like, share, and comment down below of what you think of this interaction. Shirts and other goodies are available at the Teespring store linked below. Channel membership start at just a buck if you'd like to further support the channel and get a slick lack logo next to your name. I'll see you in the next video. All links are down below.